think uh, about department stores, there are not so many uh, in London you know worldwide, and Selfridge is one of them. The drama of this collection is a film drama, it's a joke, it's an inspiration. In a way, it's me, so I have to be careful not to get too much into it, because I don't expect everybody to dress like me. Yeah? Or That's why I like this collection with the t-shirt, to make a joke out of me, because I think I'm a cartoon. I think for me to have somebody like Karl Lagerfeld working with a store like Selfridges really just shows um, two meetings of the mind. So we both are irreverent as brands and we really try to work with people who see um, the lighter side of things. I'm very, very happy to be here and I love I do love Selfridges because it's, like, it's quite near where I live. But it's just changed so much over the years and it's got everything in one spot. So it's, uh, I go, I come here quite a lot. Well, Selfridges is a fantastic store. It's right in the heart of the West End. And to have Carl here, it just gives a little bit of, I don't know, French savoir-faire, if you like, to the whole kind of idea of Olympic fashion. I think it's extremely exciting, um, super cool. I love Selfridges, I love Carl. I think them sort of coming together and is such a brilliant, it's a sort of match made in heaven. Carl is here, Olympics is here. If you're not here, what are you doing? It's amazing to be here and the, the whole vibe in London at the moment is just really magical. Carl Lagerfeld means an incredible silhouette, um, impeccable taste and structure. Everybody adores Carl because he's so astronomical in his success, in his brilliance, in his intelligence. I wish there was a Selfridges in New York, it would make my life easier. <laughs> my favorite, my favorite Carl Lagerfeld moment was in Paris where I was sitting at Café de Flore with Jamie and we were eating and Carl Lagerfeld walks up and he just sits down like smack in the middle of all of them. And people, just tourists and people in the street walking down, would just sit next to him, take a photo of themselves with him, and then walk away. And it was incredible. And I was like, he really is like this Parisian monument. He is not even faced by this. I think uh, inspiration is a muscle. This muscle has to be used all the time. Uh, the more you do, the more ideas you have. I don't believe in waiting for inspiration on beaches. Huh? 